السلام عليكم ورحمة الله Today's lesson will be about appositives An appositive is a noun that immediately follows and renames another noun in order to clarify or classify it Appositives are used to reduce wordiness Wordiness يعني using lots of words to tell something or to describe something or to classify and clarify something Add detail or details and add syntactic variety to a sentence For example, you can combine two simple sentences to create one sentence that contains an appositive Simple sentence My teacher is a kind woman Simple sentence Miss Clara is a kind woman Sentence with a positive My teacher Miss Clara is a kind woman So the appositive is Miss Clara How to identify appositives? Appositives often immediately follow a noun They always help to identify the noun One or two words Often including a name This is how you can know appositives in a sentence Miss Clara My kind teacher will help me with my research So one or two words Here it is one or two words My kind teacher will help me with my research Three or four words Often including some detail Miss Clara My kind English teacher Now we have added English My kind English teacher will help me with my research Again, four or more words Often including extensive detail or details Miss Clara, my kind writing teacher at the university Will help me with my research Appositives in introductory phrases The previous examples show how an appositive Can come after a noun it renames However, appositives can also stand as the introductory phrase of a sentence before the noun After a noun, Miss Clara, so we have Clara is a noun After it, my university teacher is a friendly woman Before a noun, my kind writing teacher at the university, comma, Miss Clara is a friendly woman A positives at the end of sentences Similarly, an appositive can be found as a phrase at the end of a sentence Miss Clara had her breakfast at Restomania Comma, her favorite restaurant My English, uh, my English friend stayed in the Kasba Palace The oldest traditional Riyadh in the city Appositives and punctuation Appositives are punctuated differently if they are restrictive or non-restrictive So there are two types of appositives Restrictive and non-restrictive Restrictive appositives Appositives may or may not be crucial to identify the noun or noun phrase Crucial it means very very important May, may be or may not be very important to identify the noun or the noun phrase in a sentence If an appositive is necessary to understand the identity of the noun or noun phrase that is being modified The appositive is restrictive So it is very important, it is necessary to understand the identity of the noun Or the noun phrase in a sentence that's being modified or being referred to Then the appositive is restrictive We call it res restrictive Restrictive appositives are not set off with commas We don't set them off with commas Example My teacher Miss Clara is very friendly There is no comma here Explanation If we remove it The appositive Miss Clara here We would understand that my teacher is very friendly Okay, My teacher is very friendly 
but the sentence is unclear. Without the appositive, we are unsure which of my teachers is being referred to here in this sentence. Is it my uh, French teacher or English teacher, etc. Therefore, this appositive is restrictive and has no commas. Now, with non-restrictive appositives. If an appositive is unnecessary, it means not important to understand the identity of the noun or noun phrase in the sentence that is identifying, it is non-restrictive. We call it non-restrictive. Non-restrictive appositives are set off with commas. We have to put commas when we are using non-restrictive appositives. Example, my English teacher, comma, Miss Clara, is very friendly. If we removed the appositive Miss Clara from this sentence, we would still understand that my English teacher is very friendly. Okay, because we are talking here about my English teacher, not Arabic teacher or French teacher. Although the appositive adds detail to the sentence, the reader already understand, understands which specific teacher is being referred to here because of the adjective English, English teacher. So including the name is unnecessary. Therefore, this appositive is non-restrictive. Assalamu alaikum tawfiq.